Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good day. It's Gord. It's Gord, you're hurting hippie, and it is Thursday. It's the day before Friday, as I prefer to think about it. This, uh, the color keeps changing on here, so we're going to try and lock it. Probably not going to work. Anyways, my friends, it's all about family today. Orlando V, we made... I uh, made a comment yesterday that uh, everybody give him a shout out, give him some prayers, give him some thoughts. He's a part of our family. And he felt really good that I mentioned that. And it's been a while since I've even brought up the weed tube family, WTF. I made that up quite a while ago. And even had a Google Hangouts where many of us would go and we were family, just family, talking about cannabis, talking about medicine, talking about many other things too that affect everyday lives. And I still believe that we all here are a family. We we are concerned with each other. Many times there's cross comments, people wishing other people well, reading through the comments, finding people that need a little bit of a boost. And that's what family is, people who care about other people. I have never, I shouldn't say never, since I grew up, no, never, never felt that family had to do with blood, the bloodline. I, I think that's a silly, monarchistic look at life, that your bloodline determines your future and who you are and your worth. No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. My first child, my first person in my life, my child, I met her when she was three months old and never missed a day after that. Never missed a day. And I adopted her by the time she was nine months old and she became my first daughter. My other three kids are all of my bloodline but are no more special or less special than my first daughter. And in my first daughter's family is three kids of two different parents. And that's just life. That, uh, and my other daughter has, has been married t twice. Well, common law and then a real marriage, uh, a, a different marriage. Let's not call it real. Let's call it different. And, and yet... Those brothers and sisters, they don't give a hoot about half-brother or half-sister. It's, it's family. Family is family. Family comes from the heart, not from what blood you can let, uh, and not from the DNA, but from those around you. And as Judge Judy Sh Scheinling, I forget her last name. Everyone knows her by Judge Judy. As she says, every person she always says child but i change it to person every person deserves the widest circle of love around them we all deserve that we should all grab onto it and if somebody's showing us some compassion show it back to them let them be a part of your family Make them a part of your family. You'll become a part of their family. And slowly, if we all just really work on that attitude, this whole 7 billion people planet will start to realize that we're all just family. Maybe we can be peaceful. That's my hopes for today. That's my wishes. That's my thoughts uh, nothing to do with anything but family, but you guys inspiring me to talk about things. So now it's time for a little known fact. We're, we're getting through this. I'm going to have to get more. Uh, what? Yeah, we did the green eggs and ham. We did the Olympics and Piggly Wiggly. 
obsessive node, nose picking is called rhinotilexomania. I can't believe I said that. Rhinotilexomania. I said it right, too. It reads well. <laughs> uh, Jason Schwartzman's mom is Talia Shire. I don't even know who Jason Schwartzman is. So let's pick something that's a little bit better. Um, <laughs> sorry, parents. According to NASA's FAQ page, there are no plans at this time to send children into space. On NASA's FAQ. There's one with that. I can leave this video on and wish you all a happy Thursday. And I'll get back to you on Friday morning. Peace and cheers. Love and harmony. Look for somebody without a smile today. Give them that beautiful smile of yours. You'll find another one creeps up right away. Peace.